Hello guys, welcome to the show. Just a quick video. Today I'm gonna explain because there's a lot of people asking how I did it. So today I'm gonna explain you to you how I got power for the mega squat, how I wired it up and um, how did I rotate it from the engine bay into the compartment, into the legs compartment, into the passenger side. So let's take a quick look at that. So the W124 has this um, block on the side. So this area, there's a 12 volt when the key is turned to ignition. It does not have power on accessory, just on ignition. So that I'm used to power, I get power from here to a plug that one side is gonna go to the mega squat, other side is gonna go to the injectors, and um, the third wire is gonna go to the AFR wideband controller that is gonna sit inside the car. Um, next up is these wires, these, um, <clears throat> were well, usually over here but the connector was broken so i changed it for this waterproof one um these uh, uh, sent um, random signals like uh, temperature and stuff like that mainly temperature though um next up as i said this is a 12 volt when ignition is on that goes to my coils you can see to every each individual coil i have one cable this is how the previous ones were wired in um, I have a ground for all my coils and then for each of individual coil I have a signal wire going to the mega score. After that, this is uh, origi the original wiring loom. I just redid it uh, in fresh cables because the previous were cracking and all that and all that you know normal stuff for the years. Um, I have um, 60 minus 2 trigger wheel and the whole type sensor. So I'm taking five volt from the mega score, usually from the TPS output, if you know the car hasn't got a five volt supply. Um, five volt signal and ground. The ground goes again to the mega score, so any sort of a noise is being kept to minimal, um, so you don't get like RPM drift and stuff like that. Uh, then is the injectors. The injectors get, as I said. From there, they get a positive 12 volt constant and they're being rounded to the mega squat. So the signal wire goes to the mega squat. Uh, when the mega squat says you need to fire, it just grounds them, and that's about it. Um, we're still gonna keep the original ECU because uh, that is gonna control our, um, our fifth gear in the transmission and it's gonna control um, because this car has a uh, cruise control. So I'm gonna wire up the mega score as a piggyback. So all these wires, uh, they're gonna go to the standard plug. Uh, from some of them, like the cam and knock signal and stuff like that, I'm gonna take a signal and roll it up uh, to the mega score. Um, some one to fours, maybe most of them have a OVP relay. Behind the OVP relay, there's a, a chassis bung that redirects all the cables underneath at the moment is a mess because i'm doing quite a lot of stuff but there you go that's all the wiring for the mega squat and um, yeah that's everything about it if you need to ask any other questions please let me know thank you very much subscribe see you later